Hi and welcome to a new tutorial in Inventor. Um, here I will explain to you how you can make um, a drill. Okay. Here we have um, a geometry of the drill. Okay. Uh, I will uh, make um, an easy method to make uh, these things like machinery tools or like um, a drill as you can see here when I open Autodesk Inventor I have this one okay but you can use many methods to make this and I will show you here um, a nice method to do this okay I will close this one Let's start the uh, new part from here. And now uh, go to sketch and choose this one XY like uh, front plan and add the circle. Okay, go to circle. Start from here, put 20. Add another circle here, another one here. Press D to have the um, dimension of this one. I have 10 here and 12 here. And the distance between these, we have 7 from here. We have 5 from here, okay? Just one click and one click here, okay? To have the dimension. From here to here, and this side I would put five. Mm -hmm. uh, the design is for the constraint. Now I will cut these. I go to trim, trim all of this. Okay, that's the first feature. Okay, to do. Then the next I will use. Uh, the sweep but the sweep you have to use uh, two sketches one in this side and one it would uh, be um, perpendicular to this one okay finish your sketch and you can go to another uh, plane like this one or this I will choose X Z go to to the sketch and add the line from the center to here and put 100 okay press ask to to finish when you rotate the model you have to see this one okay finish your sketch and now you can able uh, you able to use the sweep feature press sweep and you have this um, this feature okay the one thing to change here if you have not this click here and choose this profile and the path is this one okay for the twist I would use 360 um, hundred to twist and press ok and I have this form now the next step is to add um, a chamfer to these edges okay with three millimeter and select this and this one okay rotate your model and choose these again also When you finish this with three and you like um, a designer of these things you can adjust uh, this using um, another method with distance and angle two distances okay you can change all of this uh, me I just I I am showing to you how you can uh, make all of this using 
um, inventor okay look from the top and go to sketch and choose this plan I will make a cut here okay the really design is you have to add many angles and calculate here but for me I will show you the method to do this okay I have the open profile here I will close it just with this without using any any dimension okay go to 3d model extrude uh, make it uh, symmetric and it's uh, cut okay and press here press and drag okay validate from this button and the same thing from this side add another uh, another profile closed profile like this one okay we close this next it use the same method cut here and symmetric leave the distance press ok and you have this nice drill okay now I will add um, a circle here to finish the sketch to finish the model press in this um, surface go to sketch add the circle with um, 20 or okay this one is 20 then 3d model extrude it extrude your model with um, 50 press ok and I will add the cut here using four um, circles starting from here in this point if you have not this point and we can find it here put five and you can repeat this using circular pattern okay select this one at the circular and choose this like axis and put four here press ok go to 3d model extrude it and reverse the direction choose the profiles okay and here choose like a cat okay cut it with um, with 40 price ok um, that's the final model to your drill and you can add the material to this one using iron or whatever you want here iron grey or something like that okay iron cast it's not good i will choose steel 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 like this one mm -hmm. okay this one is good i will change go to view realistic and shadow activate the reflections of the reflections okay on the solid 
at a perspective okay as you can see here you finish your model using inventor to make this um, this tool okay uh, you can find the same tutorial uh, using Fusion 360 in my channel and if you have any question don't hesitate to post it in comment thanks for watching if you like to receive more videos don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you find this tutorial helpful please make a thumbs up and don't hesitate to post a comment cheers